brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Hi, I'm Mike from 1A Auto. I hope this how-to video helps you out. And next time you need parts for your vehicle, think of 1AAuto.com. Thanks. Okay, so I'll turn my key on. So you can see my driver's side power window motor is not working. Okay, so I'm gonna diagnose what's not working here. I've got a test light. Make a good ground with the vehicle. And here's my switch. I put this, I just took a switch off the door panel and put it on here. This first you want to find the power wire. So I've got the key on on the vehicle, so there's the power's on the vehicle. And you can see that okay, there's power there. I'm just probing that, hit the metal, my light comes on, I have power there. Okay, so at this first step, I've confirmed that I have power to the switch. Um, if you were not able to find that you have power to the switch, then you would need to look for either a break in the wire um, between the body uh, and the door. Usually if you pull the little boot back that protects the wires that run from bet between the body and the door, you'll find a break in the wire. Uh, the other thing is you could have a blown fuse, um, but you've kind of ruled out step one. You've got power to the switch, so power is getting to the door. Okay. There's power going into the switch, but nothing's happening. All right, so if I look here at my power window motor, I've got an orange with a white stripe, and I've got an orange with a green stripe. Coming out of the switch, orange, white stripe, orange, green stripe. So I can probe the orange with white stripe. Let's see here. See, I'm holding the switch, let the switch out. So power is going to the orange with white stripe. Power is going to the orange with green stripe. So now at this point we've ruled out the second thing, which um, the switch, we know the switch is good. Power is coming into the switch. Uh, you activate the switch one way, one of the wires lights up, you activate the switch the other way, the other wire lights up. So the switch is doing its job. It's um, directing the power from the main power supply to uh, whichever wire um, to run the motor that you want. Okay, come down here. Pull the back of the orange with white stripe. You can see power is going to the motor. Power is going to the motor. So there's nothing wrong with the switch. It's got to be the motor. Okay, so I was able to deduce that it was the motor because I know there's power going into the switch, I know there's power coming out of the switch, and I know there's no breaks in the wires between the switch and the motor. Um, because when I flick the switch, I'm able to light up the light at the connector at the motor. So it has to be the motor that's bad. Okay, we can confirm that pretty easily. We've got our new um, regulator with motor here from 1A Auto. We're going to press down on the tab here, disconnect, and then connect that right here. And you can hear very easily. As soon as we hit the switch, this motor is working. Thanks for tuning in. We hope this video helped you out. Next time you need parts for your car, please visit 1AAuto.com. Also check out our other helpful how-to as well as diagnosis videos.